Abra UTV in Central for any Liberia to cut enough for be a chicken como a war go more bujumburam no. One more etcher say, Woman here as some geo ganaha. Now as some geo woman ya our Liberia mining one and I'm so a ma or mine a boy a mumutu a bit na ganaha say. It's one best gana this year in our say. So almost shy a ma as some geo or more grono at a pre a man to question or ganaha. A beba best and finch ya best said, Juno and Sana gana betting me a sign and yana japa dear bio. I'm on mine at me a sign edgina and naso. Enti asumdue eba ebe bo papa papa omo che so omo ba ga na ha se na asumdue di omo nya bi papa papa enti omo sire obi bia se abra ye ba beto abai omo ma asumdue no a enko so afei ga na di hie nyina emmo empa ye omo so mpa ye ne se ga na be koso ama kebi ma minka bi akoso e wa bibre mu ase ye a december da eto son son no abato no ebe ko jojo omo ni utv in central for ekasai i been here since 1990 and I've been in Ghana. Yeah, Ghana is a beautiful country and uh, we, uh, we ask them that they should always remain in peace. When there's war, things do move forward. Mm -hmm. When there's war, things do move forward. You don't get no more respect again because when there's war, you don't get no more respect in the nation. Or even when you are refugees, you don't have. So I will advise Ghanaians to remain calm and peacefully and will vote peacefully so the nation can move forward. I want all Ghanaians go to the polls and use their tongue friend and do whatsoever what they can choose their leader. So we expect Ghana Ghanaians to enjoy the peace and we have been enjoying peace in Ghana since we have been here. So I pray that God be with Ghana and then this is a country that love foreigners as well as they love their own self. I've been living in Ghana for the past 23, 24 years now. They should vote peacefully and then elect who they desire to be their president. They shouldn't uh, engage into any election violence because that leads to uh, civil war. And civil war is not a good thing. I'm a Liberian and I know the negative impact it makes on a nation. So, my word of caution or advice is that Ghanaians should remain peaceful and they should go to the poor and then vote peacefully and live peacefully as Ghana has been all along. Advice the Ghanaian people and the nation of Ghana to see this as, as an, another opportunity to propagate the resounding democracy that Ghana has enjoyed over the years. And um, uh, we, Ghana has enjoyed stability for almost three decades. Ghana has accepted democracy and democracy has thrived in Ghana over the years. And we want to appeal to Ghanaians, the voting public, to be very, very far-sighted let them see the, take the interest of Ghana first because Ghana is the only nation that they have so that they will vote in peace, they will vote with love, they will vote in tranquility.